She is the only female lawmaker who has so far shown interest in running for the speakership position. Representative Inkiruka Onyejocha currently chairs the House Committee on Aviation. She believes she is well equipped with the requisite knowledge to preside over the affairs of the Green Chamber. Even if it means considering that let speakership go to another zone, I believe the eight are. National Assembly accomplished, accomplished a lot with respect to oversight. More work needs to be done. For instance, our experience as members has been that, that oftentimes we have not performed this role optimally due to our self-censorship. The lawmaker who represents Isikwato Umunochi federal constituents of Abia State justified a call on why the majority leader of the House should step down for national interest. He was minority leader and now majority leader. And so he's a leader in all rights. And this opportunity comes only once in a leader's time. Honorable Femi Bajamila, good gentleman. But there's a time in somebody's life that any leader who is a leader indeed, will pay sacrifice. As a core party loyalist, she wants the party to tell the line of fairness, justice and equitable distribution. It is our job as legislators to perform our duties with an eye on the long-term future, to look over the horizon beyond the next election, beyond party, religious and ethnic affiliations, and ensure that as best as we can, the decisions we make today will make Nigeria a better place for our, modern, for our children and for future generations to live in. She promised to, among others, facilitate better understanding of the legislature and bridge the communication gap between the Nigerian legislature and the citizens. She also listed the police reform bill, petroleum industry governance bill, among others, as legislations that she would attend to when elected as the Speaker of the House and promised to run an all-inclusive government. From the National Assembly, Grace Ike, STV News.